Uh, the balloon had a Christmas wish list tied to it, and a guy on a hike found it in Patagonia, Arizona. That's about 20 miles north of the border. Uh, based on the prevailing wind, he guessed that the balloon probably came from Nogales, Mexico. But how could he possibly find the girl who wrote it with only her first name? Just south of the border fence in Nogales, Mexico, an eight year old named Diami tied her Christmas wish list to a red balloon and sent it flying, hoping it would make it to the North Pole. It wound up here. Well, first I thought it was trash, but as I got closer, I saw the ribbon. Along the path, Randy Heiss takes in Patagonia with his dog. I unfolded the note and I could see that it was in Spanish and written by a little girl. Randy brought the note to his wife, who helped translate. The little writer was asking for things like paints, magic markers, a coloring book, and clothes. Oh, it was a kid's Christmas wish. I mean, you don't, you can't turn away from that. Somebody, some little kid put, the, put that list out there in good faith, hoping something would happen with it. And so I just knew at that moment that I had to do everything I could to, to fulfill that with, list. His only clue, a single word on the outside of the note, Diami. Randy says he searched social media first, then reached out to radio station XENY in Nogales, Mexico. Within an hour, they, they had found her. The Heises bought all the gifts they could find for Diami and her sister, and the radio station arranged a meeting last week. Their little eyes were just as wide with wonder and looking at the gifts, and how did this happen? It actually worked. Randy says in this era of border controversies, no wall was tall enough to stop Diami's faith from soaring. Well, it was beautiful to watch the, the border wall melt away for, for a day and, uh, and, and, you know, just as if it wasn't even there.